Hello and welcome to Factorio. Let's play. No, Factorio starting out. I'm a Quetio. And we are back after winter, after uh, Christmas. And that's really nice. But unfortunately, I don't have a lot of time today. So, what I thought I would do today is to create a power armor. Because what I have is only the armor, whatever that's called. That's it is the power armor. Wait, what? Oh. How could we get the next tier armor? Power armor 2. Let's try to get this one uh, up and researched and everything. There we go. So that's the goal of this episode, I guess. And we do have everything over here. That's good. Great. So, what I discovered uh, during Christmas, I have been playing another save. And I discovered that we need solar panels and accumulators, and we need loads of them for the end game. Meaning that we actually need to extend or move the uh, assembly machines further out over here. And this is the this is the accumulators, yes. And then one more from over here, from the exit, uh, from the accumulators. Okay. That's it for that. Let's see. What does the Power Armor Mark II take? Oh, a lot of stuff. Most the modules. The reason I, for, I uh, found out that we need it is that I'm walking so slowly. I'm used to walk way faster. Okay. What do we need for this? We need more speed modules. Do we? What did we say? What kind of modules? Okay, it's that one and this one. So let's see what we could actually get. We need more advanced, advanced circuits, of course. Of course, that's the problem. That's always the problem, I think. If I remember it correctly. And what is... Oh, it's... Oh no, I don't want the... Uh, I don't want the batteries. But it's the plastic that's the problem. Let's see, we do need this power armor mark too. So let's see what we can do to get it up and running. Hmm. Yeah, we are grabbing them. I mean, we have 13. And we need, we need a lot. That won't be a uh, way to go. Let's see what we can do about the plastic situation. If we can do anything. What are we missing to be able to create more plastic? Okay, it's all about petroleum gas, which is what I thought. And we have basically nothing. Well, maybe we have some lubricant. Nope, not that either. So what we need is basically more oil and yeah we have we have uh, loads of uh, speed modules here but still it's 0 0.1 we need to figure out where we have more oil and uh, go and grab that because this is gonna take ages as it's going right now maybe we could use this oil and just pipe it up let's see do we have yeah we have pipes over here I actually think that's what we have to do do we have any any pump jacks in the system no which is fair enough 
pump jacks, they take steel plate, and steel plate we should be able to grab a couple of them. I thought this was a big factory when I started this game, but uh, yeah. There's only one thing to say. Oh, I could have just asked for them. Let's see. Let's say 400 of those, 300 of these, and 200 steel plates. I've been building another factory, the uh, Fun Play Factory, that's almost finished now, and there's a lot of things over there. Let's see, what do we need more? Iron gear wheels, electronic circuits, we could actually grab electronic circuits. And the pipes. Thank you. Let's grab electronic circuits over here. And we don't need to create them manually. There we go. 10. How many do we need for that space? It's like... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. That's a good number. It really is. A few more... Uh, few more electronic circuits. Oh, let's stop that. More electronic circuits. More uh, iron gear wheels. go 10 15 that's good now let's go oh do we have enough pipes we probably don't know are we creating pipes somewhere yes over here it became awfully dark awfully fast yeah we did run out we run out of power we need more accumulators but not in this episode. Like that. And then we need some more underground pipes. There we go. Now we have what we need to create those oil pumps at least. So let's go down and create those. And then see where we end up. How is it we want... Oh. oh, this is actually the spot. I thought it was further down. Okay. Let's do this. Hmm. Yeah, and let's start without any power to be able to hook everything up. Uh, and when I say hook everything up, I mean with pipes. Come on and create those, please. I might still uh, move them around, but I just want to mark out where I, where I have them now, and then we solve the rest of it. Let's see, we should expand this, and we can expand it while we are waiting for the, uh, for the pump jacks to be built. Oh, but we do have, we do have uh, blueprints available. So clear this, and please create another one, this one. Create it. Place it, place it. I'm following this to be able to add more of these, uh, whatever they are called. But basically to be able to have more, more stuff, more oil being, being pumped up. I think this is a good place to bring them. Well, no, we could go further. What about over to the right? 
yeah then we go as far to the right as we can and still we feel that we are in the right spot oh yeah why didn't i do this Something like that. We should hook it up here. And then we have everything to work for. So today, by the way, I will be doing one uh, big episode. Instead of cutting it up and doing all the fancy stuff. Not that it's very fancy. But still a little bit fancy. This is good, then we can connect those two, I think. Or maybe we want to... I actually think we want to move it up here instead. And we're working on the last ones. So let's start with the, with the piping while waiting. go like this and I guess let's go like this ah there is no need to do that over here we can do this and oh we have two more do we want to move it over here yes I think we do actually and this one, let's move it to the left side. This one, after that. Hmm. If we push these ones up. No, we are not. We're pushing them to the right. Oh, I thought that would actually work. I thought that line was free, but never mind can do it anyway. Just can't get through over there. But that's fine. And now we have our last two. Hey. I'm missing one oil well. Let's have a look. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Which one am I missing? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, uh, thirteen, fourteen. Have I been miscalculating? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. No. There should be one below, I think. There we go. This one. It's 159%. There we go. And what do we do now? I'm thinking about sending it over here. There we go, sending it up over here, oh, and then we can just add, uh, add connections, and there we go, so we have one connection down here, we have these, this one we haven't connected anywhere, okay, let's connect it over here. And connect it up there. I know we said that we didn't want to do this, but I figured out that we can't we can't avoid it really. Well, we can of course, but it doesn't make sense. There we connect the last one. Then we have this one. Let's see if we connect it like this. There we go. 
something like this. Now we should get... Oh, and then of course, I forgot about these ones. There we go. Everything should be connected now, to the oil at least. Except that these two aren't. Hmm. Okay. Let's connect them somehow. Let's do it like this. There we go. Everything is connected. We don't have any oil, but if we have oil, it would be good. So now let's get power poles down. And eventually we will connect. Uh, we will con or we will add modules as well. But that's a future thing. So we do get some oil up now. Hopefully that means we do get some more oil and some more stuff uh, being being processed. Do we have any productivity modules we could use? Maybe used by smelters or something? Oop, no. Well, technically I guess we could use these ones. Because this one doesn't seem to be smelting a lot of uh, stuff anyway. Or doing a lot of work. Let's grab that and let's grab those modules. And then let's go down and see what what uh, pump check have the most oil. 1.3, 1.4, 1.9, okay that's good. 1.8, 2.3, yay. 2.6. Well, I don't think any of them are really good, actually. But 2.6... Wait, they have stopped. Have we... We have filled up the pipes. Okay. Then let's not worry about this. Let's uh, move move the modules back where they, uh, where they were. Oh, we actually have... Uh, Modules in those two as well. Where are the modules? Where did they go? What? Didn't I grab the modules? I'm fairly sure I grabbed all the modules. And then I ask, then yeah, I grabbed them. Where are they? I don't know what happened, but they are all gone. Basically. Let's add this one as well. Since we obviously have another one that can work. But how much output do we have now? Zero, 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 and zero lubricant. But I guess the stuff are being used. And at least we have loads of input. Oh, not over there of course. But over here we have everything full oh this is oh this is petroleum gas that's not like that but this is full that's working as good as it can oh come on this isn't working that is not connected whoops using modules and everything and then forgetting to connect it let's see underground pipe Let's connect it over here. 
And then we just need to see to get some power in. Maybe we'll do this instead. And add the power pole up there. Get rid of this one. Ah, let's add it again to have to have power for that light. This one isn't working a whole lot. But I guess it's just uh, it's just that it it doesn't need to work that much. Ah, basically nothing is happening with these. Let's do what we planned and grab the modules. And go down and add them to some of the uh, some of the oil pumps down here. 2.6, 2.4, those two will get it. There we go. Or maybe that's not the right way to handle it, coming to think of it. Maybe it's better to just add a few more refineries. Because they seem to be working working hard now. Yeah, they are working fully. And nothing is filling up. We need more refineries. Do we have any refineries anywhere? I don't think so. No, why should we have that? Let's assume we don't. And let's create two of them. And then let's go and grab the modules again. Yeah, I know. I'm messing it up. But hey. Those aren't working that much. I thought they would be working way harder than they are. Oh, and let's... Uh, we have this. Let's get rid of those water pipes. And let's create some more. We need those for the new refineries. Oops. Hmm, how should we actually connect the refineries? I don't like the idea. Oh, do... Can we have one there and one there? Oh, we have two spaces in between. Okay. But it is enough to have it like that. I don't know where this is going. Oh, nowhere. Let's go nowhere. Let's remove it. So the ID. Put it over there. Over there. And over there. And over there. And over there. Then we have it running again. And we should have some refineries ready to go. There we go. Okay, and then we just need some uh, pipes. Luckily we thoroughly prepared this, making it uh, really easy to add more refineries. There we go, it's just working. And we still have nothing.
Oh? This is stopping. Why? We don't have water. Okay. That's fell. I forgot to connect the water back up again. <laughs> Oops. Okay. I did see it being down to 5, but I thought, oh, that's just some temporary thing. But nope, it wasn't. But it's working now. That's the important thing. And we get a bit more, uh, a bit more of this plastic, plastic stuff right now. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. I want to use the productivity module of on these two to get bonus stuff. And now we have more than enough petroleum gas to to be able to run these two at least. Not fully, which is actually good, because then we know we don't have too much. We don't have to hurry to get this one up and running, but we do want it, definitely. Okay, now well, let's see. What do we have? If we want to create this one, we need modules. We could grab speed modules. We could actually grab efficiency modules as well. We could grab that from the uh, from the smelters. We will do that. Alien artifacts, 50 and 40 processing units. Let's go and grab it. Let's see, 40 processing units, there we go, then we need alien artifacts that we have down here, oh, come on, 50 of those, 50, there we go, and then we only need speed modules and efficiency modules. Which is, of course, the hardest thing to get, but we will just cheat by getting what we already have. So let's go up to the smelters. Whatever they are called. Furnaces they are called. Let's go up to those and grab all of the... Uh, all of the modules we have up there. No, not all of them. Five modules up there. Come on. Five of those. Oh, we have 26 normal efficiency modules. Let's uh, fix those. But let's first worry about the oil. Or not the oil, but the uh, speed modules. Five of those, and I don't think that affects it as much as it would grabbing it from the beacons, since the beacons power more than one. Let's go. Now we have that. Let's uh, empty this one out. Oh yes, this is only the first step. Then we want stuff in that, of course. 100 processing units and... 30 alien artifacts. We want at least one more uh, power power generating thingy. Whatever the correct name of that is. Hundred modules, please. Sixty, seventy. Ah. Okay, we need There we go. I might have gotten something else, but that's fine. 
Oh yeah, and I do know that I got some batteries before that I didn't really want to get. So let's leave those. 30 alien artifacts. Do we have alien, alien artifacts? In that case, let's request it instead of uh, go and grab it from the from the belts. But yes, now we have this new power, power armor mark 2. Let's fill that with stuff. Then we have reactor, two batteries, mm, robot ports, and what do we more have? Energy shields and legs. Do we have any legs? Well, oh. Maybe we haven't researched those yet. Let's see. Exoskeleton equipment. Yes, please research that. Look how fast this research is going. That will be finished before, before I know what's happening. And we have another one of these fusion reactors. Great. Thank you. Now let's create some legs as well. Oh, we need engine units and processing units. Whoops. Oh, but we don't need that anymore. Please remove that. Hmm. No, not that one. This one. Electric engine units. Well, do we have those? There we go. They actually go on for quite a while. Oh, they go all the way down? That's nice. Oh, when I'm here anyway, I think I have... Is it green circuits I have loads of? Yes, it is. Empty out those. That button. We need, let's say, three skeletons. That's 90 of these. Almost. Steel plates, we have enough. Processing units. Processing units, we need 30. Three of those. Do we have everything afterwards? No, we want some more energy shields. Mark two, of course. Which takes... Oh, advanced circuits. Let's grab those. Let's grab a couple of these. And plastic. Of course it takes plastic. The one thing that I don't have a lot of. Oh, iron and uh, steel. That's fine. Plastic. We need to load up to 100. There we go. And then we can go up and create our own extended shields as well. Oh, that's not the menu. This is the menu. Let's see. Three exoskeletons. Actually, we have one robot too much. Oh, let's stop. No, let's continue with this. I think we will have four energy shields and four exoskeletons. I changed my mind. Electric engines, we want some more of those. How many do we need? 30. 
so long ago we did this. There we go. And then we need... Let's see. We need another one of these. Great. Okay. Can't we pick up any of those? Like a hundred of these. Hundred of those and like a hundred of those. There we go. Hundred and fifty of those, I guess. And then we have the red circuits. I don't think we can do a lot about that, other than just creating them manually. But they take... Oh! Here we go! They take so long to create manually. We don't really want to do that. Yes! This works out fine. This is exactly what I planned. Yeah, right. How many belts? Two rows. Well, it's a few. So this was gonna be a short episode. It's not... Oh, copper cable we could return. And iron gear wheels. It's not too bad of an episode since we are, uh, we are showing everything. Oh, we don't have any more uh, copper. Whoops. Copper cable, there we go. And iron gear wheels. Well, let's see. There we go. And there we go. And there we go. And there we go. Come on. There. All of those are gone. Good. How does the power look? Well, it looks fine. No problems this night. I can't hear anything. Not from the game at least. So let's restart the speakers. Yeah, now I have some sound again. And please, come on. Personal robot port. Well, we have a four. We don't need five. Four is quite enough. Then if we have a 50 robots, then we have 10 in reserve. That's, that's perfect. Oh, could I get rid of those inserters? I don't think I'm gonna need those anyway. And if I am, I could always pick them up again. It's not a big deal. Oh yeah, if we want to move the things again. The red circuits we have to cut down, but that's fine. That's actually more than fine, because we aren't creating anything anyway. And the rest of the stuff seems to be okay. Oh, <laughs> never mind. But what is happening with all the trains? Do we have some kind of gridlock? Nope. No, everything is working as it should. It's just that we don't have a lot of mines, I guess. What? Oh. I wonder what uh, mines we have for the copper. Actually, while everything is being built... Oh, where is my train for? Yeah, I guess... Oh, we have this one. Oh, we could just do this. Let's search for copper. Oh, we have one copper ore station. Or copper ore mine. Probably we should...
extend that to have two of them. Stone, maybe over here. Why not this? How is it with uh, blueprints? As I said, I haven't been playing this save for a while, so I don't remember how everything is set up. Well, it's not that good, but it's okay, I guess. We can always create a new blueprint, no problems. Oh, what? Okay, something is definitely happening here. Let's move this first and then fix whatever is happening. Uh, I just noticed that this one, these weren't being mined out. Why is this full but we have no train? Where are you train? You are further down here. Oh! What is happening? <laughs> Come on! Oh, okay. No fuel. I guess on the under. Or empty cargo inventory. No. Or. Inventory empty. And inactivity for five seconds just to avoid getting running out of the fuel do i have any fuel on me no but i can grab some fuel there we go hopefully that solves all of it i think it should oh this is doesn't look good what's this i don't know Nope, let's uh, let's remove this. We don't need this anymore. Actually we do. Come on, we shouldn't. Why didn't I set it up to get all of the ore? Oh, uh, power, power, power. There we go. 3.4 and 2.3k. That's a lot of uh, ore to mine. And we didn't set it up that way. I don't know why. But hopefully we have solved the train problem for now at least. Let's just go through all of the trains and see if we uh, if we have any other problems so let's start from the coal coal unload yes copper oh, all that and inactivity defense i don't know i don't know And inactivity, inactivity, I don't know. And inactivity, was that, I don't know, four note was, I don't know, three. And inactivity, mining load, mining unload. Oh yeah, these are the special trains. Stone, we need to handle these ones as well. Oh, oh, stone unload until 15 seconds pause. Oh, and 15 and five seconds of inactivity. Yeah, I guess that's fine. That's uh, another way of setting it up that I'm not used to, but that's fine. But now we have everything created for this, meaning that we have. Loads of legs, loads of shields, loads of robots, and we even have some extra power. So let's run around and have a look. 
This is way better. Way better. But uh, anyway, oh, and we have some stuff getting into the into the system now, which is what we wanted. Why are the robots going over here? Oh, they are del delivering ammo for this train. That's fine. Let's let's not worry too much about that. But it seems that we have the factory running again, and that's great. Anyway, thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye.